Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing and quick review of this NJSJ M500 USB gaming microphone. This is currently listed on Amazon in a lower medium price range, has very good reviews. It has a patented cool gaming design, a long USB-C cable and uh, I mean it doesn't have many features but it looks really solid, really tempting, very modern so I thought I'll give it a try. It also comes with a two years warranty. Here we have some descriptions or here at least in the back it's a little bit small to see. Yeah, here some specs as well. Sensitivity says around 45 decibel, which would be also in a medium range. I think this could be a really interesting device, especially for gamers who don't have too high expectations, but still want to have something really solid and also fancy. So let's take it out of the box and see what we get. What I really like is this new kind of stand. I've already seen this before and it totally convinced me. This is much better, more, much more safe, much more fancy than the old style uh, tripod which were used uh, for these microphones. This is uh, the thing which you want. And here we had a long power cable uh, USB-A to USB-C. This is also what you want to see in 2021. We don't want to deal with micro USB or these uh, very old-fashioned large USB plugs anymore. And here's the microphone. It's quite heavy. It's not super heavy. I think outside everything is plastic, but makes a good impression so far. And you can see regarding the mount, that's so easy here. Uh, very easy to screw in here. And then you can see it has a very, very solid stand and we can move it around. I mean, it's, it's not an omnidirectional microphone it's a cardioid microphone which has the best or highest sensitivity straight from the front but at least you can point it to the height which you need this is a huge advantage we have one button here for the color and for the mute and that's usually uh, the only thing which we need some of the microphones which are a little bit more expensive they have some kind of live monitoring or gain control but i have tested this already with an even higher price device and it hasn't been working some manufacturers they just write this and then it's not working then you get disappointed here we know from the beginning it's not here but usually that's something which you don't need uh, this is a, a really special thing if you are a pro uh, that then you might need this but then you are not going to buy this microphone so so this is definitely something which we don't need in this price range so we actually get everything what we need and something which is also really good you can see that they have their website or at least facebook page and they have their support uh, if you need something and we also get some kind of small instructions manual but it's actually not needed i mean this is usb plug and play maybe here the specs again if you need that but sensitivity again minus 45 decibel yeah i think that's about it so let's just plug it in and see okay i've started my computer my laptop and plugged it in with usb a here usb c setting up the device we're setting up t1 and now it says device is ready t1 is set up and ready to go so looks like everything is ready and now we can use this button here what we see when we short press i mean this is a sensor button you don't have to push it in or so it's just a little tip and we just short push you can see that the light is turned off and now it's on mute and when we push again short then it's recording but we can also use a long push to switch the lights i think there are seven different modes you can see we have this uh, light changing mode or some kind of breathing some really nice options here so i think everybody can find its favorite colors now let's also see if it's uh, recording right away we have this voice recorder here 
and let's see I think it's recording from here yeah you can see it's definitely recording from here so usually or I uh, would say probably 99% of all the cases you have to just plug it in into your Windows computer or whatever computer you're using I mean it's compatible with many more uh, operating systems uh, but here uh, on Windows I can tell you just plug it in and usually it will then switch to the latest added device which is this one here so really nice and then make sure that you have the perfect angle to you so you are in a in about a 90 degrees angle away from the center of the microphone so I'm going to record something for you and going to listen to that first and I'm going to play that for you as well so you can listen and decide how good it is. Microphone test NJSJ M500 12345 First test was about one foot away now I'm getting closer 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 and now I'm just about two inches away Pop test, pop test, pop test, pop test. So I hope you have been able to listen to that. And of course, I've also been listening and I was quite positively surprised about the quality, clarity, sensitivity. I mean, it's not the greatest sensitivity, but I would say for this price range, it's very decent and it is picking up very natural sounds so very comprehensive range of audio levels from high to low this is one of the most important things that you don't sound like weird on the other side that people won't notice that see that it's you and this won't happen here that's a really really nice thing what i also noticed that it's probably one of the best things to be about one foot away from the microphone if you go closer of course you will have higher sensitivity but it will pick up some pop effect when you're going too close but actually it's a good uh, microphone and especially regarding pop effects I mean as long as you keep some distance it's very good in avoiding some pop effects I would say if you maintain maybe four or five inches of a distance and there's almost no pop effect only if you are going closer then you can hear something but even when I was uh, about only two inches away it was really hard to detect so I, I think this microphone is doing a really good job even though it doesn't have like windsock or pop filter outside so overall I like the thing I would say it's it's a very decent microphone at this price range really beautiful one very modern one and if you want to buy this for you as a gamer or want to make this as a gift for for some young people gamer or so uh, you can't do anything wrong and I'm super happy with it and so I'll put down the link to the Amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it and I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel thanks for watching and see you next time